Hello everybody, Andrew Majewski here with Dental L. So I'm actually just about to see patients in about actually 25 minutes, so I might have to cut the video short. So you might be wondering, how do I prepare for when I have patients come to my home office? So what I do, which I will actually show you guys around with my webcam here. So I'm just gonna take that to just kind of show you guys around. So here we go. I don't know how long the cord is, but let's kind of manage. So can you guys see this okay? So this is the patient chair. This, this obviously stays here because I do have my um, mobile practice as well where I have my own chair. But this one obviously stays here. Um, these are just to make the patient feel more comfortable and I do put those in the laundry after every single patient. I'm seeing a four-year-old and a five-year-old. So that's why he is here. So we can count the teeth together, we can polish them. And my cord doesn't go far enough, you guys. So I'm going to do whoops, another video later to show you guys what that's about. But behind you here, I have my air, um, water, the suction. I have the piezo, which I will not be using for kids, but I just have that out anyway. Um, and then let's see, I have my tray. Oh, it looks like somebody's at the door already. I have a toy box, laptop. Okay, guys, I'm just going to stop the video for one second because I have somebody coming. Sorry, guys, that was just Amazon. <laughs> Anyways, oh, and while we're here, look at my cool light. How neat is that, eh, guys? Yep, that is in my office. So if you guys can see, oh, sorry, it's starting to, to get blurry. I know, this is not the best video, I apologize. But that is my tray set up here. Um, I'll actually show you guys around my office right now. I have a little tray, or sorry, a little tray, a little chair for people to sit in. I have my like cubicle areas for like odds and ends. I try to keep it tidy. I have my like oral hygiene aids up here. I have my, my um, um, water. My iPad is there for them to watch Netflix. But actually, I'm gonna put that away because I decided to put Netflix on my computer. So that way it's just easier for them to see. There's my cool computer. So now you guys can see kind of where I sit when I do the videos and here's my chair. So actually let me go in the corner here. So this is what it looks like in the corner. So a little stool for somebody to sit in, um, a chair obviously, patient's chair and all the goodies. Okay, so I'm coming back here. Sorry guys, this is not the most organized video ever I apologize but so what else do I do I put Netflix on my computer I used to have it on my iPad but it just makes sense to put it on my computer because it's a bigger screen so, so they have something else to listen to so the kids have something in the background um, I clean out everything actually in my hall so I should actually do another video to show you guys that um, I might just take a, a video of it with my cell phone or something but I make the hall completely patient friendly. So I take away my coats, my husband's coats, my boots, shoes, all of that. So it's just sort of more inviting for patients to walk in. They don't actually sit there because I see like one patient at a time or a family. If a family comes in, they're normally in the room anyway. Um, the dogs, I have four dogs. I keep them downstairs in the basement. They're perfectly fine doing that. Um, I have a washroom too that my patients can use. I put clean towels in there. I do have um, a salt lamp in there too, like just for some extra light. They can obviously turn on the light as well. Um, I make sure it's, it's clean, which is probably self-explanatory, but hey, um, what else do I do to prepare? I just kind of tidy up. I try to make it as you know home-like as possible, but so they don't know that I just spent 20 minutes getting ready in the bathroom before they got there. Like I keep it clean, tidy. Um, but obviously for patients to use. My home office, I keep it as clean and tidy as possible so that patients can come on in and they have room to sit and do all of that. I talked about Netflix. Um, I have my laptop over there with my charting, with the schedule. Um, I do have Square, I'll show you guys that. So if patients wanna pay by credit card or Interact, um, debit. This is amazing. It just makes it so much easier. Um, I can leave the link for you guys on the bottom there. If you use the link that I provide you, if you need this for your own business, for something, um, you can get actually free transactions for a couple months. I forget exactly how long, but I can do that for you. Um, what else do I do? 
that's kind of it, you guys. Um, I have everything kind of set up where I give them like toothbrushes and everything, but I can show you guys that in another video too. So I might do that with my laptop actually, so that way I can carry it around and show you guys around. So again, sorry for this unorganized video, but you know what, this is real life. I'm not a YouTube star where I spend half an hour editing an hour's worth of video or, you know, whatever. I don't do that. I don't, I don't edit as you guys probably know. So this is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know though if you have any questions and I'll talk to you guys soon. My patients should be here any minute. It's now 1141. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.